Namaste. Hello, everyone. I'm Alkanandama, Ayurvedic doctor and principal of Alandi Ayurveda Gurukula, an Ayurveda school in Boulder, Colorado. So uh, yesterday we had the celebration of life for our beloved Jane Bunan, who has been for so many years the president of Alandi Ashram leading board member, such an important part of the ashram. So uh, to honor the occasion, I did write a poem for Jane that I'd like to share with you. I used the Tradesh Tibetan poetic tradition in which you can write a poem where each stanza features one letter of the person's name, so the poem is titled Jane Bunan. Joyful Jane, dancing Jane, flowing in bright colors, my bold and fiery Aries friend. Ayurveda transformed your life, opening new perspectives through understanding prakriti, gunas, elements, and doshas. Nature was where you were at home. You hiked and climbed the mesas, foothills, and high peaks, reveling in mountain meadows blooming with pink paintbrushes, bistort, elephant ears, and Colorado columbines. I named you Vanaspati Devi, goddess of the plants. An educator to the core, you taught generations of students to see the difference between simple and compound leaves, feel the flat, friendly, and flexible needles of Douglas fir, and sniff the vanilla fragrance of Ponderosa pine bark. Botany was your vocation, united with ecology. You taught the ways of plants in their native habitat, showing us how different species nurture one another in communities and how fire can be a friend to the forest. You chose a universal path, studying with Rabzalman and Ecuadorian shamans, making pilgrimage to Mount Kailash, and celebrating with us at the ashram. At Naropa and Alandi, your vision crystallized into action. Believing deeply in these missions, you served them selflessly for 25 years. You indigenized yourself 500 leagues from New York City, here where black albert squirrels nibble on ponderosa pine cones while Estella's jay perches overhead. You will never be forgotten, even when we who love you are gone, for Flagstaff Mountain holds you in its geological embrace. 